Three Minute Thesis, Cornell University, 2018. Jason Gus. My thesis on feces may make your bones stronger. I've spent hundreds of hours collecting poop from mice. Hi, I'm Jason Gus, and no, I don't spend my free time in pet stores, and no, I'm not just doing this for fun. I'm doing it so I can study the gut microbiome. The gut microbiome are the trillions of bacteria cells inside our gut. In fact, we have more bacteria cells than we do human body cells. And the gut microbiome serves vital roles for us in terms of metabolism, so we can get vitamins and nutrients from the fruits, veggies, and occasional McDonald's we eat, as well as an important role in our, keeping our immune systems healthy. And because we've seen such an effect of the microbiome on major organs and on our immune system, we thought, can the microbiome also influence our skeleton and how strong our bones are? Well, that's exactly where my thesis comes in. In the US every year, there are 9 million fractures that occur. And in hospitals, we try to predict who's at risk of fracture by measuring bone density. However, there are a significant portion of fractures that occur even when a person has normal bone density. And we think that the gut microbiome may help to explain these fractures that are occurring when people have normal bone density. So we took mice with a normal, healthy gut microbiome, and then mice with a disrupted gut microbiome due to lifelong antibiotic treatment. And what we found was that antibiotics not only changed which bacteria were in the gut, but also what they could do. And specifically of interest to us, we found that the microbiome's ability to process vitamins important for bone health was reduced. We then looked at the bones from these mice, and we found there were no differences in bone density. However, when we did strength testing on the bones, we found that mice with a disrupted gut microbiome had reduced bone strength. And this is important not just for mice, but for people too, because small changes in bone strength can have a big impact on one's risk of fracture. We also found that the structure of the calcium in the bone was changed. And we're currently working hard to find if this can explain the reduced bone strength. We are really excited about these results, and this is the first time people have looked at the gut microbiome and how it might influence bone strength. By understanding how these changes occurred, we can use the microbiome to prevent fractures from ever occurring. And that might make all that time spent collecting poop worth it. I predict that in a few years from now, instead of seeing an ad for gut milk, we'll be seeing one that says gut microbiome. Thank you.